All right, I want to talk about cams here for a moment, if, uh, if I can give you a little information on this. Um, from the factory, Volkswagen installed up to 71 what was called a flat cam. And the way to decide whether you've got a flat or a dish cam is if you pop the oil pump out, you can look in there. And if you've got three rivets, that's a, a flat cam. The difference between a flat cam and a dished cam is just that. It's got a deeper dish to it, so it requires a longer shaft on the oil pump to engage into the slot to actually pump oil. Um, so you can glance in the oil pump hole as well and decide whether you've got four rivets holding the cam on for a dished or three rivets for a flat. Um, a lot of times customers will order an oil pump and not realize that they've had an uh, upgrade in a cam. When you, when you have a performance cam, they're always going to be flat cams, always going to be early style. Um, so you want to make sure you get a flat style oil pump. The way to tell that easily um, if you have a couple oil pumps laying in front of you is if you match up the mating surface where it butts up against the case, you can see this tip is much further out than this one. This would be a 71 and later or known as a dished cam oil pump. Um, while we're talking a little bit about cams, and we've got oil pumps for, for high volume and, and many different applications, and you can certainly give me a call and I'll go over that with you. Um, all performance cams, whether it's Engel or, or SCAT, um, they've all got a sequence in which the gear, the replacement bolt-on gear, has to be bolted on the camshaft. Uh, otherwise your cam timing will be all out. And what you want to do is the back lobe opposite the gear is always going to be 180 degrees out from the timing mark on the, uh, on the gear itself. So you'd want to put that 180 degrees away before you bolt that on. So your opposite the lobe is opposite the dot on the cam. Um, that applies for all camshafts. Um, if you have any questions on any of this, please feel free to give me a call. There's a lot to cover with performance cams and special grinds for different engines. Uh, you know, and it goes all the way into valve terrain and valve springs and, and shimming of the valves. Um, but give me a call if you have any questions. This is a, a good idea. It gives you a good heads up.